So we see again the handoff to number 34, who is in for the touchdown. That is first drive, first score for Finland, which brings the score to 6 0. Fantastic running there from number 34, who, if she continues like this, will no doubt have one heck of a game. So it looks they're opting to go for the field goal. Both kickers kicking well in warm ups. The wind has just picked up ever so slightly just before the kick, so we'll see how that affects their kicking. But see if we can make this 7 0 with D point after. That is the snap is bodged, and we're going with the release play, and it is just missed by the touchdown scorer, number 34, who could have taken the uh, two points. So that is Finland 6, Austria 0, a positive first drive from Finland with one penalty and just a little miscommunication in the backfield that let them down, but I'm sure they will work on that. And again, no motion, but this time handoff again to their running back, number 34, who is so far having a fantastic game. And that is why breaking tackles and breaking it to the outside, is she is going to be chased down, but that is going to be another touchdown by number 34, which brings it to her second of the tournament and her second of the game. The decision based on the previous snap to go for two in this same formation. And again, they're going for the pass. Number seven looks to be open at the back end of the end zone, but that is just overthrown. There we go. There is the motion from number seven this time back. It looks like the snap has been number seven gets a block in. And is it going to be recovered? It is recovered by Austria. The penalty and therefore the bot snap affecting Finland hard and this is a chance for Austria in this second quarter to try their very best to get a score before going into the half time and potentially getting the ball back twice in a row this time looking to pass and the pass is up but it is caught and put out of bounds by number 81 from the Austrian offence who was covered by two uh, Finland defenders on second down in the red zone but this time it is thrown just over the top shoulder and not quite capitalised on but that should realistically have been a score for the Austrian offence so we have the motion again by number seven this time in front but it is handed back off to number 34 who again is through the blocks and into open field being chased down but not quite going to be caught and she is in for the touchdown once again a fantastic play by the Finland offense who are really really doing fantastic things with this inside running with that running back the first field goal didn't quite go their way the snap wasn't fantastic but we see the motion from number seven is handed off again to number six and that is in comfortably for the two-point conversion see an interesting looking defensive formation from the Austrian team which had just resulted in the ball being run away from them as number six breaks into the open field and takes in for the touchdown number six Kempai Emilia who has now scored successfully a two-point conversion and is being used as a really good power back alongside number 34 and it's a handoff to number 34 who has successfully taken that in for the two-point conversion a motion again from number seven so back to what we're comfortable with and the handoff successful but just missed the tackle from Fenish. It bounces off another of the Austrian defenders and that results in the score the motion this time coming from the other side and handed off to number 32 who decides to take it to the middle of the field and it looks like she is in for the two-point conversion. Let's see if they can again put more points on the board. So it's a good snap and the leads bogs off. And 34 again through a big gap that's been created by our offensive line. And the Austrian defence cannot quite get a handle of hers. They score once again. As there is a... Great run again from the Finland offence to result into the score, which means that we are seeing still a dominant showing from the Finland offence. 
but we'll see how Austria come back onto the field in their next game. Again, it is a round-robin tournament, therefore there is still a chance to succeed. And that looks as though to be the game as the official puts the ball any second now, I'm sure, into the air as the players leave the field. That is a fantastic showing here from Finland, who lead the score 52-0 at the end of the fourth quarter. Really flowing hard from their crew of backs, particularly number six, number 34, and that fantastic offensive line that really pushed them forward. Penalties hurting hard for Austria, but still, there is a lot of football to go, and hopefully we'll see these teams really play out for the rest of the tournament.